Hello, everybody, and welcome, or welcome back to Dome Keeper. It is a mining slash sort of base defending or dome defending roguelike that we checked out about seven or eight months ago back in demo form when it's called Dome Romantic. Uh, I think it was actually like the first video on YouTube for the game. And then we came back to check it out when it was renamed to Dome Keeper, and now we're checking it out again because it is out on Steam, and I'm very excited to give it a another look here. So I think we'll probably just head on in with, you know, all of the basic stuff uh, right here on even on normal. I don't know. Will we do hard mode runs? That depends if you guys are excited about this video, the, the possibility of this being a series or something. That's something you'd have to let me know in the form of likes and comments and stuff like that if you if you care. <laughs> but alas, let's get on into the actual game itself here. So here is our dome. We must keep it. You know, we we go down here, we do a little bit of mining, uh, you know, I kind of like to get a nice clean straight down uh, shot, but let's go for a little bit of mining out to the sides. Uh, we're going to be looking for gold and things like that so that we can, uh, you know, purchase upgrades. You see this line right here? This means that there's there actually can't be any more digging stuff there, so we kind of want to uh, avoid that just for optimal, yeah, for optimal uh, nature, be better to dig sideways here. There we go, until we find a little bit of gold. And then we can pick this up. Okay, got a little bit too much. Got to learn the uh, the controller controls here for this. But we'll take it right back home. You know, pretty standard, kind of like a mining game loop to it. But every certain amount of uh, seconds, currently we don't, you know, we don't know it right off the top of our head here. Uh, there will be a wave of monsters that will attack our base. We have to go back up and defend it. But we have uh, a similar upgrade tree thing that we can care about right here. We got three gold that we brought back, and we can upgrade our dome in some capacity. You know, maybe you see this and you're like, this is a lot of upgrades. What if I told you this is not even the half of it? Like, as we go down further, we'll get more items and equipment and things like that, that we'll, you know, be able to customize our run further, that we'll be up, able to upgrade as well. Uh, like a teleporter or, you know, something that'll tell us when enemies are coming, which in fact may even be something that we can get at a base now. I don't remember. Yeah, th th this is something you can get at a base here. So we could do that. Deplay, uh, displays the time until the next wave of hostile life forms attack, which could be for the sake of today when I'm gonna be like very uh, split you know, mentally in explaining what's going on at the basics here. It could be really handy. You see, it's in the bottom left, so, like, should I be going all the way back to get this gold right now? Uh, probably not, but I'm gonna do it, because it'll probably be A-OK. -okay. I trust myself. I trust myself. Even though I shouldn't trust myself. So let's get up here, sit down at this, uh, this right here, go over to the battle, and do a little bit of shooting. He's doing a little bit of damage to our dome. It's the first wave. It shouldn't be that bad, right? Uh, we did bring back a little bit of money here. So we have... How much? We have four bucks to play with. Install a counter that shows how many waves you've survived. I kind of like that those sort of like simple UI elements are things that you can... You can upgrade, but if you have like a really good sense or you're just so strong that it doesn't matter, you can kind of just skip them. Uh, drill strength up. This will help, like, our mining capabilities. Top speed up. Carry slow down. Down. Or we can actually increase the power of our laser on our dome. For now, I think just going for a little bit of drill strength is going to be nice and clean and effective. Uh, but we don't want to stray too far away from our base. See, look at that. Just one. Oh, my God. There was just gold right here. All right. Pick it all up. You can see you can only bring back a certain amount at once, really, right now. Uh, we'll obviously be able to, like, increase that as we uh, upgrade ourselves more and more. But it has that kind of really satisfying, uh, like, Terraria, Minecrafty loop to it. I don't know where the top is. Okay. There we go. Alright, we're getting into, like, slightly tougher mining capabilities here. But that's it's got that simple loop that you kind of look for in those, uh, those crafting survival style games. But in a, like, a digestible run style for oh my god oh my god format i can't wait to get some upgrades on these but the thing is the wave's gonna be you know it's gonna be here in a second should i go and do this probably not 
but it also shouldn't uh, slow us down too much. Okay, get up, 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 get up. Sit down, get an upgrade. Maybe we can upgrade our drill right now. Maybe that'll make that worthwhile. Uh, the laser moves faster, improves the power of the laser, but it moves slower while firing. Or add a little aiming laser. For now, I think we'll be okay if we just say power. Oh my god, wait, we, we only have five! Oh, that's because, I was like, we brought so much stuff back, but it's because we bought uh, a lot of the crystals. Okay, well, that's not going to help us. I'll spend one to see my dome structure. Uh, repair damage done to your dome with cobalt, and then what's this? Melee damage reduction. Let's get both of those, like, right now. Uh, right before things are about to potentially go wrong, and then we can get something else. Uh, top speed... How about go with the uh, bigger carry capacity? All right, here we go. Battle. Move, 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 move the laser. Move the laser. Move the laser. Blast them. Oh my god, it is it is quite weak. But we do have that melee resistance now, which should be pretty helpful. All right, get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Uh, it's worth noting, yeah, a bunch of people have been covering this game, so there's obviously, I'm sure. Uh, a very clear meta that has been defined about this game, but I know I covered it uh, in, in the past, like perhaps the most in the past that you can get for this game, but uh, I've kind of tried to remain unspoiled with all that stuff. So, you know, it's it's all good if there's like an optimal way to do things, like cool, 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 I'm happy about it, but I kind of like to go in a little bit more fresh myself, so I don't really know what the, the main strats are or the meta is, so be kind, be helpful, but be constructive, you know? Like, that kind of stuff. I'm, I'm happy to hear. I'm very happy to hear. Okay, so we have six. Let's get the uh, the power. But uh, here's the thing, what I, what I assume and what I hope, is that there's probably going to be a... a lot of viable strats. So what you see me doing right now, like, I would like to have uh, it be very efficient for me to dig here by going for, like, a... Uh, a two wide of this instead of a one wide, but you see it gets kind of tricky when these darn materials get, there you go, a lot harder to break. See, I'm kind of revealing two at the same time. I uh, I also should have gone back. Should have gone back. This is going to be a little bit painful. It's going to be painful. Not a good call. Not a good call that was. Is it just the one? It's just the one for now, but there's also a laser boy up in the sky that is now dead, and we're good. All right, we who who cares? We it didn't even matter. It didn't even matter. Uh, maybe it'll matter later, but for now, we're all good. Let's go for that. It's optimal. We're checking. We're checking two. We're checking one above, one below. Uh, when we do it this way, because you see, you know, the top one was already checked. All right. Ooh, we got something. Right in that final tile there. I think this is going to be cobalt. Wait, no, 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 no. We we learned that cobalt is uh, is purple. It's not cobalt blue. Cobalt is not cobalt blue. That is a misnomer. That is uh, oxygen, I think. I think that is oxygen. Could be wrong there. Okay, a little bit of gold, a little bit of gold, a little bit of gold. A lot of bit of gold, a lot of bit of gold. Can we carry this all back? We did get that increased carry capacity. I think it'll be okay to head back now with this. All right? Shouldn't be too big of a deal. We're a little slow, but it's also just fine. All right. We'll let that stuff get ground up. All right. Well, how much do we have? We have six to deal with. We could go for... Um, I don't know. Laser moves faster. We could... We could kind of just get a feel for how the combat's going, and then maybe we just save our stuff to get something else. Increase the amount of damage the dome can ab absorb. Active Trigger an active combat ability that creates a deadly field effect around your dome for a short time. Duration 3, 20... Okay, once per battle... Use water to manually overcharge your shield so it absorbs more damage the next wave. I mean, that's pretty cool. I like the idea of this active ability, though. It just gives me an, an extra thing to do. So X is going to be the Electroblast. 
I don't know if it's actually X, because here's the thing. I am playing with a PlayStation controller. On PC, to be clear. So, I'm playing with a PlayStation controller on PC. So, I, I don't know. The controls that it says are not the controls that I actually have. So, apologies if something gets a little bit uh, flubbed in the mix there. Oh, here we go. Okay, so this is the big loop right here. We want to find these and bring them home. Uh, I believe there are... I don't know. I don't know how many of them there are now, and it also could have changed. So I'm not even, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna tell you how many there are. I definitely know the answer, but I'm gonna keep it a secret. Uh, but we're gonna pick a gadget. So these are the things I was talking about that let you really change things up. Uh, a two-way teleporter with a station under the dome and a portal that can be placed and moved around the mines can be quite handy. Adds a machine under the dome that slowly produces water through condensation, or shred the gadget and gain two cobalt. I mean, a teleporter sounds great and everything. It's also, like, a lot to manage. I kind of like the idea of just passively gaining water all the time. That seems really handy. We could get one of those things where, like, our uh, our dome, you know, could overcharge because uh, if, if we put in water, it could be really, really nice. But for now, I'm kind of, like, I've been trying to go for these ones that are a little bit easier to mine. Okay, so yeah, we got we hit our wall over here. We know we're good on that. So we, we're pretty much, everything here is all cleaned out. Everything that really, uh, that matters, at least, yeah, at least I'm sh pretty sure. Okay. It's a lot of cobalt. A lot of cobalt. Repair damage to your dome with cobalt. I mean, if we want to, we could, I guess. Or we could save it and get even more uh, resistance. Okay, so here is uh, the new tech tree that we get for the condenser, which is such a fun little thing. I don't know. I like tech trees. I like tech trees that are confined into a game, not meta progress stuff. I mean, yes, I know I've talked about that, but um, I like the stuff when we get new ones in a run and we know that we're not going to get everything so we kind of feel like we have to draft it out so we got one for the condenser here so we can increase the speed at which it uh, produces water 1.2 cycles interesting auto overcharge keeps your primary gadget permanently overcharged without using up water okay condenser water production will be delayed after overcharging Okay. Why would I leave there? Why did I think that we could, uh, it would just go automatically? Okay. Fun thing is, a lot of the enemies do get stunned as you hit them. So you can really use that to your advantage. I think we had out, we're looking for a bit more gold. Alright, what is our primary gadget? What is our primary gadget? Also, have we fully explored over here? Eh, more or less. I'll, I'll check again here. It kind of like branches out like a upside down ice cream cone, you know? Uh, some people call them triangles. But I am clearly hungry, so it's an upside, uh, it's an upside down tri triangle. Uh, triangle. <laughs> triangle cone. Oh, boy. I, 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 <laughs> I don't know, man. Let's go back here. Let's bring the gold in. We should be able to get something good. Six is nice. But, like, I don't know if I feel like I need to upgrade my laser at this moment. And I think I'd rather save up for one of these things. Speed could just be handy so we spend less time, like, finagling between things. What the hell? What was that? Is there a like, mechanical impact to a lightning strike, or was that just spooky for the sake of being spooky? Alright, we're gonna wanna head back. We're gonna wanna head back. We got a little bit faster speed now, so we can go a little bit, uh, a little bit riskier. Okay. Go, 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 spin, spin, spin. I mean, a, a little bit more speed on this would be great. 
I'm not gonna lie. Because look at how slow it turns. These are the enemies that you want the speed for. I will say the laser, uh, the aiming laser. It's for chumps, though. What do we have, though? For, okay, we have three cobalt still. Cobalt is pretty handy. Pretty useful, pretty handy. I think we'll want to save it. Curious about this. Further reduce the time needed to condense one water. Automates your water collect and remo removing the need for you to pick it up manually. Hey. Produce and store two water before it stops working. I mean, I'm going to miss the optimal time to go pick up that water. Like, I know for a fact. But oh well. All right. Should we start digging this? Because this is, this is an unoptimal digging pattern. It's okay. It'll turn optimal in a second. All right, there we go. Come on, man. Oh, my God. Just, how about some gold? How about just a little gold for Papa? Okay. Got that uh, that upside-down ice cream cone. As it were. Oof. The further down we get, the more of this stuff we're going to find per, like, node. As you can see, oh my god, this is where everything was. Okay. Alright, you know what? We'll go through this way. Don't want to lose anything. Is this a one tap? It is just like a little one tap. We don't lose that much time moving back if we go for it like this. So we remember there's that huge chunk down there. Okay, I'll tell you what, I'll grab this water as well. Oh, come on! Okay, so that's enough for us to get... the speed up if we want it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. They're coming at us from both sides here. Oh, oh my god. Well, should I have stayed over there? Probably not. Is, this is this is a rough wave by comparison for sure. Much rougher wave by comparison. Well, it's fine. I'll just let the one through. We do need to use that electro blast. I'm aware. To be fair, I'm aware. But you know what? All the comments are uh, are fine. Helps with engagement. Thank you. Um. Hmm. So we could repair. We could repair. We'll consider it. Right now we have like a mother load down here still. I don't even know if we can bring back all this in one. Oh, we can, but it'll be slow as hell. It, does, it doesn't feel worth it. It just does not feel worth it. I kind of want to test the Electro Blast. Gotta remember, where, where is X at on, a, on an Xbox controller? It's... Not where an X hat is here. Is it? I can't remember. Alright. What do we got? Uh, we could... Hmm. Get the extra that. I mean, a little bit of repair. One, one cobalt would go a long way here. I tell you what. Let's just go for the actual permanent defensive increase. Like, it'll make this go further for us next time we uh, we need it. Uh, six, eight for that. All right, we're fine. We're fine. Go, 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 go. All right, run down. Should we be running all the way to this? I mean, here's the thing. I know for a fact that I at least have something I can pick up. Oh my, that is unbelievably time-consuming, that one. Okay, go back. That's good enough. That'll be enough for me to pick up a different uh, a different perk. Are we heading back at a point where there's going to probably be monsters? Yeah, 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 yeah. But, again, I'd rather go back with a little bit of stuff here, I think. Okay, so we can pick up an upgrade to our laser, maybe? But I'd probably rather... Let's get the drill strength. Alright. 
So the Electro Blast. I would assume that that's going to be in melee range exclusively. Yeah. All right. It's got to be. Let's go for this. Okay. That's not it. Square. That was the Electro Blast. It turned off my laser too. It seemed neat, but maybe not as big of a deal as I had thought it could be. Not, I'm not really too uh, too upset that I hadn't used that. Obviously, we're taking a decent chunk of damage, but I'm trying to invest in my character over my dome here so that we can, um, so like we can always upgrade that later, right? It's not a big deal. Health is a resource in games like these. It's fine. It doesn't really matter. As long as it's not zero, you have enough, right? Like, if, we, if it's something we can utilize to potentially increase our exponential scaling, then it's something worth sacrificing. Mm -hmm. All right. That being said, would I love to increase it? Sure. I, I, I certainly would. Certainly would. Go, 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 go. We don't need to stay to watch it. Okay, so we can pop those in one now. Okay, so we have this, at the very least. Let's dig back towards our, our standard mine shaft here. Okay, this will be good enough. All right, we found like a really good chunk there too. That is beautiful. It is beautiful. Back home I go. A little bit of water, we can pick that up on the way up. All right. Good care. Not right now. More laser power. Swivel head laser. Install a swivel head into the laser that automatically corrects your aim if it comes close. Hey, I mean, sure. Uh, double laser, power three. Like, we'll be able to pick between one of these in a moment. I'll go for the extra power about now, I think. Get them ready. All right, I got... Yeah. Sure. Goodbye. Punk. Okay, hopefully that... Did that slow them down? You look like you're a bit slower. I think I'm going to need to read the exacts on uh, what that's doing for me. What are the exacts? Trigger an active combat ability that creates a deadly field around your dome for a short time. Blast stun 3. I don't know exactly what that means, but... I mean, sure. Okay. So we could invest pretty heavily into that element, too. Interesting, interesting. Let's head on down, though. We know we got a bunch of gold just waiting for us right here at the bottom. Okay. Ooh! A little bit of cobalt. A little bit of cobalt as well. Oh, you son of a gun. I mean, at least we got a nice, clean, straight shot. How much was down there? Two? Three? A bit. Bing. Bong, bong. Bing. And now, I will repair one. Okay, four. Four, nothing we can upgrade that'll really help us at the moment. I don't care about how many days I survived. If I'm alive, I don't really care. Like, I'm sure you could use it well to figure out, like, you know, I need to go back because this type of enemy spawns on this day and I'm weak to that. Like, maybe that... Nice. Maybe that's something you could figure out. How slow do we go? 
Yeah, not too bad. We'll, we'll be able to make it back in time, I'm pretty sure. Scootin', scootin', scootin'. Ah. Just a nice visit right back up. Install an automatic lift that brings mined resources up for processing in the dome. We could take that. Uh, machine under the dome that produces blast charges, carry them into mines to release them and detonate. Let's go for the lift since I've already, like, I've already put in the, um, the legwork to, you know, uh, make it convenient. Do I care about the laser? I don't know if I care about the laser. I'll do that. So where do I, where do I do that for manually overcharging? Assuming right there. Oh, you punk. Shoot. You know, I'm not turning around yet. A little Electro Blast. Okay, so it seems like it's largely for the damage, right? And, I mean, a little bit for the stun, largely for the damage. good we're good what do you have left okay two and two we have nothing else we really need the cobalt for right now not sure install an additional lifting orb oh wait lifting or is this it was it boost your speed when you move inside i feel like this has been uh this has been tweaked i don't know what you mean by lifting orb yeah that was not a thing before it's been changed a bit so yeah it goes straight down in a line uh, this is why, like, it's one of the reasons why it's very convenient to obviously, um, build straight down. It's like just one of, one of many. Okay, so there's a new biome. Oops. Okay. So get that all going right up. Is it the most convenient in the world? No. But, like, here we go. Is he going to start working? Is he going to start working anytime soon? I thought... What the hell are you... What the hell are you doing? Where the hell are my bubbles? Oh, that's... Okay, so that's how they work. Gotcha. So they go... They just go up and down? Yeah, that's different. That is different. Um, but we have a large reason to desire water now. So I will definitely be happy to, to pick that stinker up. We have two water. Uh, let's see. Orbs move faster. An additional lifting orb boosts you on the side. We could, like, that's the thing. We could use just use it that way, too. Fine. Oh. Oh, so that's like multiple upgrades. Gotcha. Do I just hang it at the ready? At this point, probably shouldn't, but... I'm gonna do it regardless. We might get lucky and like pop a pool over here. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, screw you. Pop all these. Oh, there's some behind the rocks! Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Goodbye, sir. Stuff's pretty brutal there. Go for a repair, I suppose. Not too worried about it at the moment. All right, so I'm hoping that these... I'm hoping to see some gold slowly making its way up right here. That's what I'm hoping to see. Oh, okay, good. I'm I'm comfortable kind of just mining off to the side a little bit then, like, while it's still going to be a little efficient. Not bad. Okay. Ooh, that's kind of ooh, that's kind of a nice strat. We could just like 
drag it. Just for a second, just put it all in the laser. So that it it'll be it'll be making its way back up at some point here. We may drop a bunch, like because of the Ooh, look at this. Oh, that was like a little bit of a life hack, though. A little bit of a life hack. So certainly we've gotten a bunch up there. Is it worth, like, just going down here a little bit and just running up a bit more myself? Arguable. Arguable, we might take a little hit as a result, but... I think the amount of money we'll get should give us the ability to, um, hopefully upgrade our weapon. Oh, God. Oh, that thing stops running. It stops running in the middle. Okay, so 16. We got a hell of a lot. Okay. Uh, laser moves even faster. Seems like a really good call. Um, sure. I mean, we're gonna take hits. Like, we're gonna take some hits. That's okay, though. Alright. How are we doing? There's, a, there's still a pretty noticeable chunk unexplored right here. Looking for just, like, some basic resources. Do we want to get all of it? Like, I don't know if, we're, if the meta is, like, fully explore the hell out of a zone or not. I don't know. Okay, but I will say it might be like a little bit more efficient for our run in specific if we, you know, went ahead and mined a little bit closer to the center just for our build specifically. Okay. That will make it back up. We'll do it efficiently and... Yeah, we got a little bit of extra time we can go. Not too much, probably not enough. Yeah, we can probably do it. Doing a full explore here. Oof. Oof. We're cutting it a bit close. We're cutting it a bit close. Come on. Let me squeak up a couple extras. Let me cheat it. Cheat the system a bit. Look at that. Oh, we're oh, we were bringing up one extra. I don't know why that one dropped there. Is that one going to make it in time? Is it going to make it in time? Nice. Okay, good. All right. So we're at... Ooh, we got like 19. Orbs move out. I feel like it's moving fast enough for us right now. Um, primary gadget. I think... Is that like our... Drill right now? I'm not sure. Drill faster could be nice. Us moving faster is very convenient, of course. Could wait and get even more power. Maximum laser movement speed is cool. Like, I'm not really hurting for HP. I think we can wait and then we can just get, like, a big honker and upgrade. We're getting lucky. That was pretty lucky. Jerk. If we put on the damaging aura, would these just like auto die? I feel like they would maybe. Maybe we go see if we can find another upgrade. And uh, you know, okay, stop, stop, stop. Just let that get carried up. Maybe we can find another upgrade down in like this biome. You know, one of the one of the big uh, magical chips. Ooh, we, you love to find some cobalt. You love to find some cobalt. That that's 
Cobalt is uh, is life here. You want to take this for me? Okay. Hmm. Trying to be pretty efficient here. Yep, there you go. Trying to be pretty efficient and st while sticking near here. You gonna take those for me? Take that up with you, bubble. The hell? You found a mineral tree seed. It can grow into a tree which roots into tiles. It'll grow resources depending on... The resources of the rooted tile. Drop it on a tile to plant the seed. I'm terrified. Oh, well. Cool. I guess that's... Something. <laughs> I, <laughs> I thought it would, you know, be held in the air. <laughs> by the thing that holds stuff in the air, but it did not. Superpower laser. Or double laser. Installs a second laser turret, but splits your firepower between them. Uh, so they're just, they're mirrored, if I remember correctly. Let's go for the superpower laser. Where do you have the speed? So, like, that should help a lot. Oh my god. What the hell's this thing? Dead. Oh my god, oh my, it's like actually a little fast for me. Get bodied. Get body. All right, so let's go. Let's go see what we did down there when we dropped that thing. If it plants a tree on the bottom of the mine shaft, that's cool. Ah, this is the bottom. This is the very bottom. So, like, are you telling me if I drop it on gold? I don't know what the hell. It... I don't know what it's about. I don't know what your deal is, dude. It's it. If it's going to just be like a gold farm now, that's kind of cool. Wait! Take this with you! Take this with you! Oh my god, it's so slow. It's, it was so slow to grab it. I'm very curious about this tree thing, though. Um... If we... Let's bump off, like... Like, get rid of, like, one there. Okay, come on. Grab some. Grab some! Hey, you, did you just steal from me? You just steal from me, you jerk? How dare you? How dare you? Oh, you let me grab that water. I know this is inefficient, but I can't. I can't. It's almost. It feels. Feels worse to have uh, that failed uh, efficiency of that water machine for some reason to me. Hmm. You know what? Sure. Get wrecked. Oh my god, the sound it makes. It's so it sounds so powerful. Oh, did that kill the little thing or no? Not so sure. All right, I'm curious about that tree thing. We also, I think, need to find that final little uh, space potato chip. Okay, so it is clearly doing something to the gold. If it's really like planting a, a gold tree, that's pretty cool. Money can grow on trees. Okay. 
Take this. Take that. I don't know how many you can take. Oh, uh, why is this... Is the floor gonna... Okay. So if that's always the floor, then we obviously want to move it a bit. Okay. You can hold three without it really being that much of an inconvenience. Okay. Back. Back, 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 back. Back, 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 back. Here, go. Take this. Take something with you. Please. Okay. We'll drop it all here, and then we'll take it back up with us. We're... Oh, this is not convenient. Oh, this is so silly. It's, it's going to take too long. We're... we're yep. Yeah. Bring up as much stuff as we can just by having a nice... You know, that thin kind of laser is sort of helping, or the thin um, hallway is kind of helping us do that cheesy little system where we drag it up when it we probably shouldn't be able to. This seems nice. Carry more resources, lift you up even more. Um, sure. Okay, we can pick... We'll do that. All right, get ready. Blast them. Oh my god. Oh, it's so fast. You guys are gonna... The one on the right are, or the left are gonna move. Oh boy. They're not guaranteed damage, but they are very annoying. I feel like if I put the uh, the laser beam on there, it probably would be, uh, or the whatever you know, the electro blast on. It should probably be good enough to. Um... Why does it say it's healing there? I'm cool with it, but I don't get it. Do those little mushrooms mean something? I mean, like, hey, that thing you're looking for is sort of over here, maybe. No? Because I think there's one per biome. Okay. Oh, God. I think getting the thing that lets us carry more per trip could be nice. Like, for when we get really far out into the horizontals, you know, it would be really handy. Okay. I feel like this is not worth it to go over to get these two right now. Huh. Okay, well, we definitely are going to lose that one. All right, orbs. I'm trusting you. We also should move faster in the laser beam. Yeah, we're, we're definitely noticeably faster. And maybe, like, with that extra speed, look at that. We're bringing them up even further. All right. All right, all right. What are we going to get? Like, carrying capacity? Oh, God. That's the one that breaks the camel's back, huh? All right. You could probably just run, um, run the elevator as well, and it'd be good. And by that, I mean, like, invest, ah, some seconds in just running up and down, carrying the stuff that we've got already in there. Should I restore? Is there anything else that we use the cobalt for right now, aside from the restoring? Nah. Then we have an obscene amount. <laughs> we have an obscene amount of stuff. Increase the dome health? Why? I'm, I don't need it. Okay. I mean, I, you know what? what? What is the elevator for if not for uh, doing exactly what I don't want to do right now? 
I'm gonna let it do its thing. Alright. Come on. Where is this final little son of a gun? Seems like it, this goes up further. Interestingly enough. Okay. So there's the wall. Okay. It's closing in like a reverse ice cream cone. Sure. Where the hell is this thing? Okay. I mean, there's a lot. There it is. There the hell is this thing. Okay, so do we, do we need to find two or something now? Is that what it is? Perchance? I mean, we definitely don't look done, for what it's worth. We probably could have explored a little bit longer. Yeah, see, look at that. The elevator just brought up everything. It, who cares? Never doubt the elevator. Never doubt the elevator. Further increase the absorption. I mean, we have a, a lot of... We have a, so much water. I don't think we really need to upgrade that anymore right now. Is that my primary gadget? Seems good, So, if so. Let's find out. I mean, it won't, we won't be able to find out now, but like, eh. At this point, there's no point in going down further. Like, I would just go down just to come right back up. We could go down and like clean up the, the hallway a little bit on the way up, I suppose, but... At this point, I just want to... I want to give the jump on a fool. Get wrecked. Did the stun work there? That is terrifying. Okay. Hello, orb. Okay, so we got the one, but it, it it also opens up the situation. Now we know we're looking for a one uh one tile size item. The hell, man! Wait, what? I have no idea. This tree thing is so weird. It is confusing the hell out of me. It's very expensive. And by that I mean it takes so freaking long. What are you doing, tree? Bring up. Bring it up. Bring it up. I'll just trust you. Hopefully it doesn't matter that there's like no roots there. Wait, what is that? Is that... Does that symbol mean something? There's kind of like a different sort of shape on it. I guess not. Suppose nope. I think there's some gold we missed in some areas. Also, let's check this. Make sure that's the bottom. Alright, go back up. Meow. Oh my god. God, the music is so satisfying and calming and clean and nice. Alright. 11? What kind of juice can we do with 11? Orbs carry more? Nah. I think they carry enough for what I'm doing with them right now. So, do we have the permanent... Okay, so I think we do have a permanent bubble shield on. I think that that's what it's talking about. Unless it just didn't get used up. Theoretically making that better. 
So yeah, we can't, because we can't interact with that anymore. Get blasted. Get blasted. Get blasted. Uh, you know what? I'll just use my stun on that guy. Is that it for that one? That was it? Alright, back on down. Where the hell is it? Where the hell is it? We're pretty strong. I mean... There should be something in here. Unless there's one in every zone or something. Like, I don't, I don't know what the system is now, if it's changed. And I guess there's nothing saying it can't be close to this one. Lol. Okay. In fact, are they like, are those wires pointing to something? Ah, here it is. Here it is, the juice. Very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. We, we should have enough time to get it here today, too. Which is really, really, really nice. Maybe not. I think it's, I think it's pretty darn heavy. Okay. Yes, there's the cobalt there, but... Uh, let me tell you, it, it shouldn't matter. We should have just uh, theoretically won, I, I think. If I remember correctly, this is the win condition of this mode. Just like you got to survive, survive, survive long enough until you can go down long enough to find one of these stinkers. All right. So yeah, theoretically, if I remember correctly, monster's gonna run wild here, and it's gonna be like an overwhelming situation. Like, this doesn't really matter what we're doing here. It can be fun, but like, it doesn't really matter. It's not letting me do my Electro Blast. And then the magical artifact comes out to save the day. Bada bing, bada bow! Your dome is saved! New world. Wait, new world unlocked? New map size unlocked? Unlock a new element. Uh, pick your on. This is cool. Score points by sending home as many resources as possible before the dome falls and you safely leave the planet. Install a tank that produces monster repelling liquid. Activate to spray inside the dome. I mean, I'll uh, I'll unlock a new mode first, I suppose. That seems probably like the the logical thing to go for there. Um, but yeah, there's a new keeper that's gonna show up. A new, not yet unlocked the sword dome. This is not yet available, but coming soon. Send okay. Score points by sending home as many resources as possible before your dome falls, or you safely leave your, or you safely leave the planet. Wow. All right. Uh, recharges automatically. Gotcha. 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 So that's that's our primary gadget. That's our primary gadget. Gotcha. That's the shield itself. I, I forgot that these are also something that is going to be uh, changeable. So that's what we, that was the other thing we could have unlocked was a completely different gadget. Which we could use to just repel uh, potential monsters instead. I kind of, you know, I like the shield. Um, but hey, alas, alas, that is that. Uh, and that's going to do it here for today. If you guys want more Dome Keeper, like I said at the very beginning, I, I'd be happy to do a little series on this. If you, if everybody is, you know, kind and understanding and, you know, like, if we, if we got a positive situation going on here and you guys leave likes and comments, all that kind of stuff then I, I would love to check out Dumbkeeper some more and see what the, uh, the... I say full version because it doesn't label itself as early access, meaning it's like it's confident it stands as a product for the price it is charging, uh, meaning... How much is it? Sorry, that was my uh, Steam saying something about my controller. Uh, the price is... 
1619 uh, currently on sale. So 1799 normally 10% off right now. Not, now is the time to get it if you want to get it because uh, that extra little sale there. Uh, but you can pick it up. It seems like it's got a lot of extra replayability and elements that it has offered here. It's just a very satisfying game. Like, I this was one where when I checked it out, when I checked out the demo, because I think this was a Ludum Dar. No, was it Ludum Dari? I don't, it was a game jam game. I don't know if it was Ludum Dari. It was a game jam game, though. Uh, and then it was made in, in, like, I was very curious about it in, like, then. And then it was made into a demo for Steam. That's when I checked it out. Uh, and I, and I just really knew, I think you can, you could tell in that video when I was playing, I was blown away by how, like, just how together this game had it, even in that early state, it became very clear to me that it was going to be something quite, quite great. And, uh, obviously it has, so, like, since that first, the, you know, that first video I made, so many people have picked up and checked out this game and it seems like it is doing quite well for itself. And I'm, I'm very, very happy about that. Uh, you know, it's got picked up the publisher of Raw Fury, you know, I, I Raw Fury, I have, you know, a lot of love for, uh, you know, we've worked together in the past, uh, and they are great, great people, and so it's just kind of like a great project all around, just really nice stuff, really, really nice stuff, so that's why I love to, I love to support, uh, you know, great games from great devs with great publishers, all that stuff, it's just a perfect storm of greatness, so if you enjoy it, uh, make sure you pick it up with the link at the top of the description, especially right now with the 10%, uh, since it's, you know, a little bit, it's not like expensive, but it's more on the, it's more on the expensive side than what people are expecting right now. Uh, but it totally stands at that price in my opinion, but Hey, thank you for watching. Check out the channel. Rogue likes and more every single day. If you want to be notified when games like this come out, uh, like I said, with the first video on YouTube for this game, it means that I kind of like, I'm on the hunt for things like this. If you want to have heard, if you want to have heard of this game eight months ago, this is the channel for you. This is the channel for you if you want to have heard of things like this, you know, months and months and months before they hit the big public eye. This is the channel for you right here. Thank you for watching, though. Check the channel. Rose more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.